Time now for First Alert Weather with meteorologist Kyle Kleckner. Welcome back. Thanks again for waking up with us this morning. Let's get a look at your heading out the door forecast for your July 13th on this Thursday. Temperature wise, starting off in the 60s. Might have some fog though as we walk out the door. Temperatures will be warming up some into the upper 70s by that lunch hour. We'll see eventually 80s for this afternoon. Might see a break in. The, we have a couple of storm chances today. One this morning, another one this afternoon. You might see a little break early this afternoon in between these two rounds of storms that we'll have. Temperatures out there now, mainly 60s across the board, 62 up at Ord, 63 at Hastings and York. A little bit warmer off to our south, 68 at Imperial, 70 at Concordia, as well as Oberlin and North Platte right now, too. So some nice temperatures out there this morning. Also, it is very muggy out there. These dew point temperatures, very similar to those temperatures right now. It is sticky, 60s dew point temperatures right now. So very muggy outside. And with that said, we combine that with some white winds for the most part. With the exception of North Platte, of course, 34 miles an hour. That is from an outflow boundary from a thunderstorm this, that we're seeing in that area this morning. So white winds elsewhere across the region. That is leading some patchy fog and areas of dense fog as we're seeing in McCool Junction right now. Take a look at this Hunter Vieira wireless camera. There, there's the water tower in town. Temperature wise in McCool Junction is 63 degrees, 100 percent humidity. That means the dew point temperature is the same as the temperature. And of course, those white wind also contributing to that fog this morning. Here's a live look at the fog elsewhere across the region. Visibility near zero around to say Hebron, Concordia, Holders, and Kearney. So lots of fog out there this morning. Might want to take it easy on the roads. Allow yourself a little extra time to, for your morning commute this morning. Here are those thunderstorms from there's that uh, outflow boundary from North Platte that we were seeing earlier. Those thunderstorms working off to the south and east right now. Maybe some heavier thunderstorms, say in between, say Stapleton and North Platte, like we get some rain in between there. So that's just the first round of storms this morning. We're expecting more this afternoon. There's a slight risk of severe weather in place where all hazards are going to be possible for us. Damaging winds, large hail, probably the main hazards there. Can't entirely rule out that tornado threat either. Here's the first round of storms moving through this morning, and then this afternoon we'll see additional thunderstorm development across parts of western Nebraska. So be on the lookout for that today. We'll be having more storms into the overnight hours tonight and through the early morning hours tomorrow and likely part of our Friday as well. Temperatures this afternoon, 88, pretty seasonal. We'll watch out for those showers and storms, though. Here's those high temperatures today, mainly 80s. Got some low 90s out there farther south and east as well. And then temperatures the next week, well, be pretty steady and consistent, mainly up mid and upper 80s for us. Temperatures finally starting to warm up by the middle of next week. We might have some 90s by, in the mix by Wednesday, 91 there. Got some good rain chances these next couple of days here. And of course, severe weather in the forecast too. So be on the lookout for that. Also, look out for that fog this morning. Oh my gosh, it was so bad when I was coming in. Yeah, driving in this morning, it was, you just slow down a little bit. Yeah, and the cool junction has just disappeared. Right, well, except we, the water yeah, tower. Yeah, we see, we know it's still there. The water tower is still there. <laughs> yeah, it still exists. All right. <laughs>